There are changes ahead for Kohl's, the retail giant confirming today that they've had an offer to buy out the company. Fox 6's Brett Vickery with what this means for the Menominee Falls-based company and what it means if you own stock in the company. While the company has been around for a while, um, there are investors that are just not satisfied with the performance. The Kohl's Board of Directors has a decision to make after the Wisconsin-based retail company has been presented with the option to be bought. So you see these two competing ideas about what needs to happen with Kohl's. On the one hand, the activist investors are saying, hey, performance has not been great. Even looking beyond the pandemic, it has not been great. It is time to make some changes. And then the folks that are running Kohl's say, hey, we've got a lot of great partnerships in the works. We are confident and optimistic about the future. We want time to let that flourish. Lydia Hu with Fox Business says large businesses have had to deal with issues like this, especially during the pandemic. Retailers across the board in the sector are facing pressure, particularly the brick and mortar locations, um, in part because of the pandemic and the reduced foot traffic to malls and stores for shopping needs, but also because there's just been this change in consumer behavior, folks shopping more online. Who says it's too soon to tell how much would change if Kohl's were to decide to go through with the sale, from the customer shopping experience to the involvement of a shareholder. The shareholders would be bought out essentially of their shares and the company would not be publicly accountable to their public shareholders. Kohl's Corporate says shareholders do not need to take any action at this time until the board of directors makes a decision. Reporting in Milwaukee, Brett Vickery, Fox 6 News.